Okay, uh, this tutorial, I'm going to go quick because there's a lot to cover. Uh, we're going to try and find the algorithm of this keygenme. Uh, that's the formula I use to calculate a serial from a username. So here we go. We're going to open it in Ollie, and we're going to run it. We're going to pause it, and then we're going to view executable modules. We're going to go back to ours, so now the code is unpacked. Now we can read it. Uh, it is running. It is hiding. It's right there. And now if we or to search for all intermodular calls. We can pop down to our test right here, and we can see if we put a breakpoint here, oops, and we run it, and we click check, we'll see our serial in EAX. Why is it there? How did it get there? How is it written? I don't care. Let's find it out. Following the dump. Here it is. Okay. Um, so, first of all, we could just uh, start walking through all of these calls here. I have reference points on them, and it's making it annoying to put breakpoints. So, and each of these calls is going to do something that we're not entirely sure what yet, um, but we'll find out as we go. Uh, I'm going to show you an example of something one time, and then you'll have to try and do it on your own the rest of the time, because if I show you how to do it every time, we're going to be here all day. So, we're going to check key, we land right here, we we came up quite a ways, uh, the reason I stopped there is because above here we just see all this garbage, and uh, don't think we really need it. So, if we watch this push here, it's going to push this address, uh, which if we follow in the dump is capital U. Uh, if we were to check, uh, we know that this is the first character of our name. I know this because I checked earlier, but if we put in a new different uh, a different first character, it's written here. Uh, this is going to get the hex value of it and store it in EAX. Here's the AX 55. All right, cool. That's a U. Uh, it's going to move DX AX. It's going to put this 0055 in right here, and here it does. It's going to multiply that value by 2. It's then going to come down here, and it is going to then get our 55 again, our U, um, and it is going to multiply our AA right there with the uh, 55. So the first character doubled times the first character comes down. Now it's going to get the length of our username, and here's how I'm going to show you I know it's the username. If we follow it with F7, we're now inside that call. If we come down here and we follow this as well, no, we don't want to follow that. We want to step over this, step over this, and now we see an EAX user. The very next call is length, and it's going to change the length of what's in EAX to the length, so it's going to turn to 4, and it does. So I'm going to come back to where we were, I'm going to run, and we're going to land here. So, if you don't know what a call is doing, you just need to follow it until you see what it's doing. Uh, this is going to add to our serial uh, the length of our user. Again, if you follow this through, eventually you'll see it move our serial, the two digits that were in DX earlier, into something, and then you'll see it move the length of our username into something, and then you'll see it call the add. Uh, that's the last time I'm going to explain that. Uh, now we're going to see that happen in EAX. Now it's uh, 3876 instead of 3872. We come on down. Now we're going to free list. I don't care about any of this stuff. It's unimportant. Uh, now we're going to get the length again of our user name, and now we're going to multiply it with something. If you follow this through, you're going to see that it multiplies our length of our user with 100. And uh, now we'll see that here, 190, if you look at it here, and decimal is 400. And if we keep going down, we'll see uh, that it takes our first part of our serial, converts it to decimal, and we see an EAX. It's going to move it somewhere. Now it's going to get our 400. It's going to move that somewhere. It's going to concatenate the two together, and we see our serial. So our algorithm would be first character times two times our first character plus the length. That's the first part. Second part is length times 100. Concatenate the two together, and you have a serial. Thank you for watching.